Since 1977, every boy and girl has dreamt of wielding an actual working lightsaber. But it's never been made possible until now. Partnering with Star Wars, we created a Chrome experiment that pushed the boundaries of what's possible on the web, turning your phone into a lightsaber in a battle against stormtroopers on a second screen. We took advantage of Polymer's library to set up standalone and fully configurable functional modules contained in a single HTML file for a faster and more lightweight experience. Using WebGL, we rendered an environment with the visual fidelity you'd expect on a console, displaying complex 3D objects without the need of a plug-in or long load times. WebSockets enable direct and more accurate real-time data sharing between the mobile and desktop devices, reducing latency and making the transmission of gyroscope and accelerometer data faster than ever before. Every move, every push, every tilt, swipe, or jab was matched in real-time across the web, all in hopes of escaping faster than any of your friends. No one can defeat a Sith. <laughs> People around the world didn't just lose their sh** about the lightsaber game. Oh my god, this is turning me on. They reviewed it. Brian, you and I are going to play lightsaber escape. Recorded it, <laughs> played it together, and then took it to the next level. And developers everywhere got to experience how Google is pushing the limits of what's possible on a web browser. Now, there is nothing to download. 3D graphics are cool. They were built with WebGL. Renders really fast. No plugins needed. Oh, you have it. There you go. I'm doing it right now. <laughs> it's very cool. You get to experience what it's like to fight with a lightsaber and what it's like to go to the Apple store after you throw your phone across the room pretending <laughs> that it was a lightsaber. All resulting in a massive awakening and millions of dreams nearly coming true.